What's going on guys? Here we are with a different type of video than what you guys are used to. This is actually a product review on a new supply company that's out there. This company called Smooth Sleeves, uh, they developed some innovative type of sleeve which will be getting reviewed here today. This sleeve, you will notice there's a couple of differences from you know your regular sleeve like cardboard, gold, etc. So it does have its differences and that is why I actually created this video. I want you guys to be able to see this new company, you know, develop your own opinions for it and just see what you guys think. Maybe you guys could use them, maybe you guys stick to your own different company. They in no way paid me to do this, they in no way made me do this, they in no way did anything for me to do this. This was all on my own volition and this was just me wanting to do this to let you guys, my followers and my subscribers know what companies are out there and what alternatives they are and what new developments there are in the card world. The two companies that I will be comparing is obviously Smooth Sleeves and Cardboard Gold just for the fact that that is what I would use for my cards and for my breaks. This homepage on Smooth Sleeves is definitely one of the best homepages that, that I have seen. With that slideshow with a different uh, explanations about their product, you are also directly from their homepage able to buy sleeves. The sleeves range in price. They have four, six, and 10 packs. The four pack costs $20, six pack costs $27, and a 10 pack costs $40. Each pack does bring 101 sleeves. In addition to this, you can see some user reviews, testimonials, and also enter your email for giveaways, promotions, and sales. Here, you could also head on over to the Get Yours tab on their site and this is also another avenue another way to actually purchase the sleeves we also talk some more about it here um, and what just makes their product stand out now on cardboard gold you could also head on over to their sleeves they do however sell in bulk sell in cases so that is one knock to cardboard gold the case comes with a hundred uh, packs 10,000 sleeves it is hundred and fifty dollars so a dollar fifty a pack but however, you are paying in bulk and you will need to pay a hefty price in order to get that discount. So if you're only looking for a couple packs or a couple sleeves, um, then definitely keep that in mind. Smooth sleeves, you could buy a couple. Cardboard gold is only in bulk. Let me actually open up this box. Once again, the presentation is wonderful. You see these packs, they each have their own about superhero, superman, powwow design on it. They look really, really, really nice. Um, in order to actually give you guys a good review on them though, I will be using one of these sleeves and then one sleeve of cardboard gold um, and just comparing the two and seeing if there's any major differences. Here I have a cardboard gold sleeve um, and really there's nothing impressive about it, you know, it's just your regular sleeve, uh, regular sleeve to protect your cards. However, here with the smooth sleeve, you do notice a difference. First of all, this sleeve is bigger than the cardboard gold one. The reason that it's bigger is because it has this slip up top where it allows you to kind of, you know, easily insert your cards by having some backing to it. I know that you really can't tell, but if I put it up in front of this card, maybe you could see it. It has that cut right there where it allows you to easily slip in your card, right? So you easily put in your card, right? While with a cardboard gold card, um, same process, you know, you easily slip in your card. Um, but it's definitely easier when you're using the smooth sleeve just because it has that lip to it. Especially if you're trying to put in some bulkier cards, you, you know, maybe some 60 point cards. What you typically have to do is cut the cardboard gold sleeves. But with this, you actually don't even need to cut it um, because it does have the slip. One other and final comparison that I will do is dealing with the durability of the sleeve. Um, just by wrinkling the sleeve like this, right? You obviously do see its creases. You see that it does have its dots on it. And same deal here, right? Wrinkled it. Um, you still see the crease there. Um, I believe that the wrinkles were actually the same just about, even though this one does have less of a line going through it. Um, so this actually held up pretty good. Um, although, you know, the wrinkles that I did um, won't be exact for both. Um, but I actually think that the smooth sleeve there performed better. And then one final one will be how well does it protect cards? Because ultimately we use sleeves to protect our cards. So this is a cardboard gold sleeve. I'm gonna put it in, drop the card, 
once again. Drop the card. I see no damage on this. Nothing's wrong with any corners. Um, the sleeve itself looks in good shape. So that was with a cardboard gold sleeve. And now I will be using a smooth sleeve and doing the same thing and seeing if by any chance there's any difference in the condition of the card. So I will put it in right here. Oops, have it in backwards. There you go. So I will drop it. Drop it once again. And once again, no damage to the card at all. Um, the card once again is in great shape. Uh, so both of these passed, both of these performed great. The card sustained no damage. I hope that all of you enjoyed this video. I know this is kind of a rugged review, you know, nothing fancy, but I did just want to let you guys know this new company that's out there for your supplies, smooth sleeves. I definitely think that this is a company that could take on the big ones like Cardboard Gold, Ultra Pro, and BCW. I definitely think that they can compete, and especially in the future, when more people come to see their product, I do think that they will get an even bigger following. If you do want to learn more about them, you can head on over to my description. I will be including their website link, and I also will be including their Instagram account. You can reach out to them. They responded to me in under half an hour. So if you have any questions, if you want to learn more, you could directly DM them. I personally, for my breaks, will be using smooth sleeves. I will be using this for my cards in general. So if you guys do participate in them, you know, you will be able to see them for yourselves. Please subscribe to my YouTube. That definitely helps me out a lot. Like this video, share it with other card collectors, let them know what's out there. Thanks for watching, guys.